A very warm welcome to this presentation, which aims to make clear the admissions procedures here at Hinchley Woods School. My name is Jill Twells and I manage everything to do with admissions here at the school. I can be contacted Monday to Thursday during the school day. Prospective parents are strongly advised to familiarise themselves with the full version of the admissions criteria for 2021 and supporting notes, which are available to view or download from the school website under joining us from the main menu. This short presentation aims to give you an overview of our criteria and process, but it does not replace reading the documents on our website. Firstly then, let me tell you a little about the school and the number of places that we have available. Hinchleywood School is a state-funded, non-selective, mixed 11 to 19 comprehensive academy. There are 220 mainstream places available for Year 7 entry in September 2021. Our official published number is 210, but from 2014 we have agreed with Surrey to, to offer 10 extra places. As the school is usually oversubscribed with more applicants than places available, the admissions criteria is applied to determine the outcome for applicants. Last year we received 727 applications for the 220 places. Many of you will have heard about our Cullum Centre. There are an additional four places for students with a diagnosis of ASD in our specialist unit, the Cullum Centre. These places follow a separate admissions route via the Surrey's SEND team. They are not allocated by the school and the school cannot offer them. It is a totally different admissions process. Because we have more applicants than spaces, we have to rank all applicants according to the follow following cr criteria and award each place starting with the top ranked applicant. Children with an education, health and care plan have first priority and will be allocated a place before arrangements below are applied. Category 1. Looked after or formerly looked after children. Category 2. Exceptional circumstances. Category 3. Siblings. Category, category 4. Children of staff. Category 5A. Distance in catchment and attending a feeder school. Category 5b, distance in catchment, not attending a feeder school. Category, category 6, any other applicant. There are additional notes about each of these categories which should be read and are available on our website and also in some of our frequently asked questions at the end of this presentation. Category 5A of the admissions criteria gives preference to applicants who attend one of the feeder primary schools listed and also live within the catchment area. Please note, students who attend Hinchleywood Primary School are not given priority within this category, even though it is part of our multi-academy trust. Being in Category 5A does not guarantee a place. In 2020, there were 172 applicants in Category 5A and 138 were allocated places in the initial allocation. This meant that 34 applicants in Category 5A had to be placed on the waiting list. By the 31st of August, 20 applicants in Category 5A had still not been offered a place. No applicants in category 5B or 6 were offered places during the admissions process up until the 31st of August 2020. This table gives an overview of the number of applicants who joined the school in each category over the past four years. This will give parents an indication of how places have been offered. It is important to remember that some of our feeder schools have bulge classes in certain years and this can impact the number of local children who come under category 5A. Although we have a defined catchment area shown on this map within the blue line, the next map is a better indicator of how places were offered in 2020. 
This map is, shows the distance achieved for Year 7 entry in September 2020 within Category 5A. And this area is the area inside the red line at an approximate measurement. The last place offered within this category was 1.16 miles or 1,925 metres from the school. Distance measured in a straight line from the school as the crow flies. Living in catchment and attending a feeder primary school does not guarantee a place at the school. After National Offer Day on the 1st of March 2021, waiting lists will be kept. If a place becomes available, those on the waiting list will be offered places in order, ranked by the admissions criteria. During the admissions round, the 1st of March to the 31st of August 2020, 13 places in total were offered to the applicants from the waiting list. Unfortunately, it is highly unlikely that your child will be allocated a place at Hinchley Wood School for secondary school transfer if you live in catchment but your child does not attend a feeder primary school or you live outside catchment. Please note that if you live outside catchment but your child attends a feeder primary school, they will be ranked within category 6. Applicants should note that Category 5A only applies for Year 7 admissions process up until the 31st of August. After the start of the autumn term, Category 5A and 5B are combined so that they are ranked by distance within catchment only. The feeder school category no longer applies for in-year admissions. Further information about the process for applying for a secondary school place can be found on the local authority website for year, where you live. All applications for secondary school transfer to Year 7 for 2021 are made using the common application form online through the we website for your local authority, that's the one for where you live, or by post using a paper application form. Applications for secondary school transfer are not made direct to the school. Please take note of the key dates. Further dates will appear on our school website as appropriate. We have put together some frequently asked questions, so please take time to read them through. If there is anything that is not answered, then please do get in touch. This presentation will also be saved as a PDF so you can read through the information at your, your leisure. Thank you for listening.